Next up, the men's 400-meter dash final. The American and world record held by Michael Johnson, the great one. NCAA meet record, Alain Francique, three years ago from LSU. First two lanes are always open in a 400 or 200 indoors. Daryl Williamson and Kelly Willie both have Olympic gold medals for the 4x4 relay in Athens. Karan Clement of Florida and Terry Gatson of Arkansas looking for some points for the Razorbacks. And there is the 19-year-old sophomore, Karan Clement. They refer to him as the real deal at the SEC Conference. Seven brilliant races just last weekend. He struggled a bit yesterday, but let's see what he can do today. And there is the man you were talking about, Daryl Williamson, who anchored the 4 by 400 meter relay to victory, got the gold medal in Athens, and just missed the Olympic team by one one hundredth of a second in the 400 meters solo race. And you can't count out Kelly Willie. He ran in a heat in the Olympic Games and got himself a gold medal for the 4x400 relay as well. An outstanding 400 meter field. This might be the strongest event for America year in and year out, Dwight, on the international track and field scene, the 400 meters. They will break for the pole after two full turns, and Clement out a little bit slow. That is Kelly Willie in lane four going out for LSU. He also has an Olympic gold medal from that 4 by 400 relay in Athens, and it is so key who gets that pole position coming off of this turn. Daryl Wilson of Baylor well back, but here comes Karan Clement, the sophomore, who just shifted gears and took the pole position and just gapped Willie in about 10 meters. Clement in the lead in white has the second fastest 400 meter time in the world this year. 45.29 seconds. Let's see what he can do here now. 50 meters to go for the leader, Karan Clement of Florida. And Clement blows this field away. It is Clement. It is really trying to hold off Gatson. Clement will win it, and Gatson comes up for very important, important points. Clement unofficially 44.57, which would be a world record. And he shatters that world record. Dwight shatters the record. This season was about LaShawn Merritt's incredible time on this track a month ago. He turned pro two weeks before this championship and it let the air out of everyone. But then the sophomore, Karan Clement, comes back in the NCAA final and shatters Michael Johnson's rookie record at 400 meters indoors. That is a lot. To this race you were a picture of concentration did you have any idea this would be the result a world record definitely i've been looking very hard this year to get his record thank god i'm so thankful <laughs> what specifically have you done that made the difference for you looking very hard in practice and stay positive that's it All right, well congratulations take that lap <laughs> Anyway, congratulations to coach Mike Holloway, who's been coaching him along and bringing him along. I talked about it being the real deal and a sensational performance by six one hundredths of a second. He breaks the great Michael Johnson's world indoor record as Coach Holloway gives him a big hug from the University of Florida. Just 19 years old, he was only became a U.S. citizen last year. Karan Clement wins it with a world record. Terry Gatson, eight important points for the Arkansas Razorbacks.